Hi, this is Jake from Jim Jones. I want to do a quick explanation of our <coughs> of the five movements in our 28 minutes of hell workout. Uh, first of all, I just use an interval timer on my phone. There's a whole bunch of them out there in the app store. Um, get one that's easy to set up. I set it for 30 seconds work, 30 seconds rest, and I run for 28 total minutes. Um, that way I just have to count my rest intervals. Um, this is a really easy body weight um, only circuit that gets your whole body and um, is really effective at also getting your heart rate up. So, <clears throat> the first movement is frog hops. If you get on the internet and look up frog hops, you'll see about 32 different variations of frog hops. For this one, you're going to place your hands behind your head, squat down to about 45 degrees, and I'm just going to hop. The idea here is as soon as I land, I begin to hop again, make the reps as quick as I can. Um, I am not going down to a full squat, also not pausing here, so again, just like that. So you're going to work for 30 seconds, you're going to rest for 30 seconds, four total rounds, and then you're going to rest for two minutes. You actually get about two and a half minutes rest in that break. next movement here is split jumps. Um, these get a little more challenging. They start working different uh, muscles in your legs. Again, I like to put my hands behind my head. Some people get their arms outside for uh, balance, but I'm going to show this from the side. I'm going to start in a lunge position with my knee here, and I'm going to spring up and down. There are a bunch of different variations of burpees out there. Here at Jim Jones, we primarily use burpees to elevate your heart rate, but also work on your explosive power jumping up. So for us, a burpee is chest to the ground, full extended body, hips all the way through, feet off the ground. So for that, it looks like this. Down, that, chest to the ground, just like that. So I was gonna do three of them in a row. Burpees, simple. When we do push-ups here, we are looking to make your upper body stronger, not to see how fast you can do a whole bunch of reps. So for us, my hands directly under my shoulders, down, chest to the ground, and up. And up. Pretty simple. The fifth and final exercise in this 28 minutes is really where the two hell part comes from. And we do this one hell style. The idea here is to build up lactic acid in your legs, learn to train through it so that you can ski longer, get that extra vertical in. We gave your legs a break in round four, now we're going to really light them up in round five. So we're going to start, the 30 seconds work is going to be air squats. Butts back, I sit back into it, just like that. Now here's the kick. The health style means that we're going to hold at 90 degrees during the 30 seconds rest. So I'm down, I'm here, notice a couple of things. My knees and my elbows are not touching, that's resting. I'm not sitting on my ankles. I am up, I'm actively engaging my quads, my hams, and my glutes to hold me in this position. When I get here, I like to just breathe and hold. As soon as your 30 seconds is up, you should immediately go back into your squats. It gets tough. Um, see how long you can hold it without breaking. Try to go longer each time. This will um, light your legs up big time. So, 28 minutes of hell. Pretty straightforward, pretty easy. Um, your heart rate's gonna be up through the entire rest time, so you're gonna get the increased um, aerobic capacity. Your legs, your arms, your shoulders, everything's going to get a thorough workout. This is my favorite workout to do um, at the side of the road at a rest stop in a hotel. 
um, wherever I may be. I don't need any gear, I don't need anything, um, and it's quick and easy. And uh, the way you make it harder is you just keep increasing your reps each time. I try to match my reps for every round. Uh, if I do 30 frog hops in the first round, I try to do 30 in the fourth round. Split jumps the same way, burpees and push-ups. Thanks, enjoy. Hit me up at jimjones.com if you got any questions, and have a great winter.